Today I'm scared of the doll. Uh, I don't know exactly what we're doing. We're, we're catching up, I guess. We're, um... We got a plan started out here, I guess, with the one guy, but we need a... I don't know exactly where we are, actually, to be perfectly honest. So, Funabashi. I may as well talk to him. Mr. Funabashi, I would like to ask you about the fifth report. I'm sorry, I don't know anything about that. Funabashi pauses for a moment before turning to his usual uncommunicative, uncommunicative self. When he heard the words fifth report, I thought I saw a slight change in his expression. Askochina, the hologram he made just before he died was a magnificent piece of work. I walked past his desk several times, but never suspected that was a hologram. Mr. Funabashi, would you take a look at this? This is abominable. What did you say? Did he say abominable? What did he mean? Funabashi says nothing further. Okay. Kaori? This is Biggie's by Kaori Hashitani. Is music looping or? Yeah, okay. Second year student in the master's course. Kaori isn't here today. She must be busy working on something. And Yumino? What happened to Yumino? This is the space used by Yumino, a first year student in the, in the master's course. He is not here. I haven't seen him since night of the 20th. Where did he go? I think he died. If we look at the log. Yeah, it's just since we started, so. If we go to the staff room. We speak with the lab technician, Kanematsu. Ask him what the fifth report. Mr. Kanematsu, have you heard about the fifth report? I have, I know what it is. But it does not concern you. You, you should forget about it. I wish it didn't exist. Then nobody would have died. Please tell me what you know. I have to know, please. I know I'm in danger. Somebody's after me. I know that, but I have no intention of running away. Today, I got a call from my sister. It was only an answering machine. It was only a message she left on the answering machine, but it was definitely my sister's voice. I've been feeling uneasy since I got here. I even doubted my sister's very existence, but now I know, unless it was faked. The message I got today has clarified everything. My sister is in trouble. She needs my help. You, you will suffer. Ha ha ha. Mrs. Sumi, you will suffer. Ha ha ha. Mr. Kanematsu, you know something. Please, you have to tell me. Even if you know what those words mean, you won't be able to do anything. The fifth report is a thesis written by a student who was at this lab four years ago. The student was a genius, perhaps the greatest researcher we had here, performing the greatest research. That's right. In a perverse way, perhaps that might have that might become your very lifeline. Where's the thesis now? The basement. Schroeder thesis down in the basement for a long time. What was the thesis about? That, I don't know. Even I don't know that. But whatever it was, it cost her her life. Is the fifth report still in the basement? I heard from Mr. Ichinose that a professor's ID card is needed to access the basement. Do you know where a professor's ID card might be? Only Professor Mikazuka and Assistant Professor Haibara have them. But it, it's impossible. You will be killed. Don't do it, Mrs. Sumi. You'll end up like Mr. Shina. Don't... Don't do it, Mrs. Sumi. Kanematsu begins to cry. His sobs echo through the corridor. You might know where the professor's ID cards are, but he's in no state to tell me now. 
I give up and turn to leave. Wait. Professor Mikazuka's ID card must be in his house. A senile old woman is the only one there right now. That's, I know her. Yes, we saw her before, right? But she is devoted to the professor and will do anything to protect the lab from outsiders. The ID card is important, so I think she'll be keeping it close to her. You can't just come out and ask her to give you the card, okay? Tell her you wish to write your thesis. If you say that, I think the old woman might give you the card. His words are mysterious. I know he's still hiding something from me. Good luck, Mrs. Sumi. Found out where the professor's ID card is. Nobody is here. Go to the staff room again. Is admin assistant Tanabu? Sorry, but I'm a busy man. Leave me alone. Tanabu prompts me by talking before I can say anything. Fair enough. D2 Kakizaki is missing. He is in front of the train. I, st I thought we knew that for sure, but everything's been talking like it's ambiguous. Uh, maybe I misread something. And D3 Sheena has committed suicide. But no one is held accountable. No one. It doesn't make sense. Two students are gone, and the police investigation was nothing more than a joke. I was asked to do this job in return for my debts being paid off. I knew something was wrong when I first came here. This is no ordinary lab. And so if I leave... We gotta go to that, uh, lady. Outside? I know where I must go one more time. So I'm not going to read all this because a lot of it's repeats. Can collide in the street. Is it east? West? Okay. There we go. If that house is Professor Mikazuka's, then it's likely his ID card is kept there. It's the Mikazuka residence. Again, I go to the house whose address is written on the resume. The house is old with a stately atmosphere. The nameplate says Mikozuka. Press the doorbell. Ding dong. It's the old faceless woman. Mrs. Sumi, do you need something? I know everything, Mrs. Sumi. If you need anything, ask me. Now it's time to make a decision. I want to write my thesis. That's gotta be it, right? Well, I'd like to keep writing my thesis. To do that, I'll need access to the underground lab. The old woman's expression softens. You are Mrs. Sumi. Mrs. Sumi, you wish to continue writing your thesis. I'm so glad. I'm sorry if my throat just made a weird noise. Please wait a moment. I'll bring the card right away. This is the ID card that my master used. My master said he would never come back here. Please keep it, Mrs. Sumi. Nice. Mrs. Sumi, I am so looking forward to the day you finish your thesis. Alright, bye. And this time we go east. The layout is so, uh, weird here. I'm sorry, I'm a bit lost here. North. Back to the lab. Whew. 
We want to talk to Ichinose, right? Right, yeah. Mr. Ichinose, I got the ID card for the basement from Professor Mikazuka's house. Let's go somewhere else. Wait for me on the west side of the lab, beyond the flower garden. I'll be there at night. Saying only that, Ichinose leaves. Alright, I think this is a good place to stop for today. Maybe it'll be a little short, but uh, whatever. Uh, I, I'm still a bit nervous about overwriting my saves, but the game's um, pacing so far, like in terms of unwinnable sections, it seems to be like tight enough that you only ever, at the pace I'm going, I should only ever need one or two saves, hopefully. <laughs>